Detective James Williams gathered all the suspects together in John's house for the final confrontation. He looked each of them in the eye, then delivered his verdict. David Gray was the killer. David tried to deny it, but James presented him with the evidence, including his muddy shoe found at the victim's house, his DNA on the bloody knife, his motive of being caught stealing from John and his gambling debts, which all pointed towards his guilt. David soon confessed, revealing that he had indeed killed John in a fit of rage after being caught stealing. He also admitted that he had left the torn piece of Emily's blouse in John's backyard to frame her for the crime. As he was handcuffed and taken away, Emily and Sarah both looked visibly relieved that they were not responsible for the murder. They both expressed their gratitude to James for finding the real killer and bringing closure to John's family. Detective James Williams felt a sense of satisfaction, knowing that he had solved the case based on his expertise and analytical skills. He thanked his team for their support and looked forward to the next case, knowing that he was making a positive impact in the community as a homicide detective. The mysterious murder in Oakville had been solved and justice had been served.